Yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another video, and in today's video we'll be discussing one of my favourite theories that I have, you know, taken in some information from Security Breach. So yeah, in this video we're going to be talking about what actually happened to Glamrock Bonnie, because we know he did exist in the Pizzaplex, as you can see uh, with this gameplay going on in the background right now. So when you go up to the curtain in Bonnie Bowl when you're inside Freddy, you get this voice line from Freddy. Do not come up here anymore. I miss him. So this obviously means at some point in the mall's time, Glamrock Bunny did exist. So yeah, we have come up with some theories all over the internet. And so basically this came out and so obviously in Security Breach there's a lot of collectibles. You have the uh, boxes, like the present boxes, and you also have the duffel bags which contain like stories if you want to call them them. So there is this specific duffel bag in the game. I'm going to try and find a clip of uh, where it actually is because uh, on this report that I'm reading off right now it's not uh, apparent of where it is. But basically when you pick this certain duffel bag up it is titled missing and this is basically confirming that there was a glam rock bunny so let's get into this it says security report at 12 24 a.m bunny is seen leaving his green room in rockstar row heading east towards the atrium and then at 2 40 a.m it says bunny enters the east arcade and then at 4 12 a.m bunny enters monty golf right this obviously puts monty as a huge suspect of what actually happened to Glam Rock Bonnie. So, what I'm thinking is, Monty was jealous. Bonnie's a bass player. If you go back to the original game, you see it behind me, Bonnie's playing a bass. And then if you go back to the very first cutscene, we get, when you first load into Security Breach, what is Monty playing? The bass. So, I think that Monty decommissioned um, Bonnie. And so in another report that is uh, in like the Fazbear watch, uh, it is said that it says, management report, the bowling alley needs a retheme. While most of the Bonnie art was removed, kids keep asking, where is Bonnie? Do we have an officially approved response? So this means that Bonnie has been decommissioned. And the last place they saw him was Monty Golf. So this, I think, Monty decommissioned Bonnie, sent him to parts and services to get, you know, pretty much gone, because it says here that they've gotten a re-theme and they've removed all the Bonnie art, right? So that means they're changing Bonnie Bowl. Get rid of Bonnie. They're getting rid of Bonnie. So this obviously means that they have something else in mind. Another management report also says, with, it says, with Bonnie out of commission, we are making Monty the new bass player. Parts and services have already done the proper adjustments. This could be a good thing. Monty could be even more popular than Bonnie. So, this is very serious because it clearly means that we've, we know that the animatronics have their own uh, personalities. We saw them with Roxanne at the very start of the game talking to herself in the mirror. And whenever you see her, she's constantly talking to herself, saying she's amazing, she's the best. And we already know. Monty is very aggressive from the very start of the game. Example in my series, when we first went past Monty's green room, all you hear is smashing of stuff in his green room, you hear him thumping on the glass, you hear all sorts. So he is very, very aggressive, and even in his boss fight, he is very, very aggressive. So, what I'm thinking is, Monty decommissioned Bonnie to get into the band, right? He officially wanted to be in the band because he w apparently he wasn't in the band he wasn't the bass player so maybe he was just like a different thing for monty golf he wasn't actually in the band but now with bonnie decommissioned he gets into the band so i think that's what his plan was the whole time he decommissioned bonnie to get into the original band and also i think he's trying to be the main person in the band there's two pieces of evidence that prove my point in this one if you play the Monty Golf mini game, in my series I went for Phaser Blast, but if you go to the Monty Golf and you play Monty Golf, I don't know which hole it's on, but you see Glamrock Chica, Roxanne, and Monty 
all on stage. And who is the center of the stage? Monty. And who is sitting in a trash can beside the stage? It's Glamrock Freddy. So, I think that Glamrock Bonnie was killed by Monty to officially get Monty into the band as the bass player. And then Monty wants to ship out Freddy to become the main man. And also the second piece of evidence in this is, in one of the endings, I cannot remember off the top of my head which ending it is, you see a new face of the Mega Pizza Plex is Monty, and they also replaced Freddy with Mr. Hippo. So, that obviously means Monty's plan has worked. He's got Freddy out of the pizzeria, and he's become the face of the Pizza Plex. So, what this means is, I think Bonnie was killed by Monty. It's not like officially, you know, it's just a theory, but I, it's, it's all the parts align. Like, he enters the East Arcade, he enters Monty Golf, and that's the last time they see him. Next thing you know, he's all of a sudden decommissioned. And we already know Monty's really aggressive. So, what we're thinking is there are many, 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 many things on what Bonnie could have looked like in the glam rock form. But in the game, by the East Docks, by the security office, I'll put the clip here in fine while I'm talking, um, there is a little room. It's when you go past Chica in like that kind of, um, it's like the kind of boiler area, you see a little drawing on the desk of what seems to be a glam rock rabbit. Also, just off the top of my head when I'm just talking right here, I also remember when you first play the game, when you first get into the daycare, and you first encounter Vanny. It's when you get in the um, rechargeable stations outside the daycare, and you see Vanny dance past the window, and Gregory says this. Not the fountain! You didn't see the dancing rabbit lady right in front of us? So, he's obviously talking about, like, Vanny dan dancing past them, and he says, there is a rabbit jumping past the window, right? But Freddy replies with, there is not a rabbit at the pizza plex anymore. This could be implying to Freddy talking about Vanny, or this could be talking about Glamrock Bonnie, but he doesn't actually want to open up about Glamrock Bonnie not being there anymore, because obviously Freddy and Bonnie are best friends. So, what is actually going on at this pizza plex with Monty? I think that is the question that needs to be answered, and I think it's pretty much already answered. Because if you look at this design of Glamrock Bonnie, you see this. As you can see, the legs are somewhat similar to Chica's, somewhat. He has the dungarees going up, he has his new guitar, as you can see, it's not like the original one, but it's, it's still a bass. But the main area of focus has to be the glasses. If you look at them glasses, and you look at Monty's glasses, they are the same glasses. This, this obviously is another piece of evidence of what if Glamrock Bonnie was killed by Monty to get into the band, to be the new bass player, Monty took his glasses, and there we go, Monty's in the band. And then obviously you see Freddy in the trash can, and that means Monty tries to get rid of Bonnie officially and become the face of the new band. But that is not all of what could have actually happened to Glamrock Bonnie. I've seen many, many theories. That's just my theory of what could have happened. The Monty theory is just what I've, what I've pieced together. And yeah, I think a lot of people have pieced it together though because it's kind of obvious. It's not really like, oh, I found this out. Look at me. I'm so cool. You know what I mean? But I saw this one on Reddit and it's a very, very, very cool idea. And it could it could be true. Here here is the Reddit post. It is posted by you dream underscore raider four twenty. It was posted about eight days ago, and it's under theory. And it is what if the reason they got rid of Bonnie in the first place was because he was fused with William Afton's body. So what this means is obviously when you first encounter Burn Trap, he's officially got a name. His name is Burn Trap in the files. You can see, if you're up and close and personal with him, you can see he has somewhat of a glam rock shell. And 
it is not official but we don't see any other type of animatronics getting into the recharge stations other than the glam rock animatronics so chica and freddy and i could be wrong here this is me just going off the top of my head i don't think roxanne or monty well we haven't had a look on monty's green room probably well i haven't but in roxanne's room to my knowledge there is no recharge station but in freddy's there is and i'm i'd imagine in chica's there is so what if vanessa vanny hacked into monty to decommission Bonnie, to then take Bonnie's shell down to wherever she took the place, underneath the whole pizza plex, into this FNAF 6 location, got one of those, um, one of the, got one of the recharge stations, rebuilt Afton after the burning of his body in FNAF 6, and fixed him with Bonnie's shell, left him to like. It, obviously it didn't really like it was it was not purple let's all be honest he's very messed up looking but then she put him in the recharge station to recharge his body to then show up as burn trap what if that is what happened to bonnie so we have two theories we don't know which is true true i think the monty one aligns up more because it makes more sense but the vanny the whole thing is very very interesting so yeah we see in that photo what we could have seen with glamrock body what he could have looked like but yeah that is all i've got for this little theory video and yeah thank you all so much for watching if you did enjoy this theory video make sure to smash like button down below make sure to comment on what you think actually happened to glamrock Bonnie. and yeah i'll see you in the next video guys peace